Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. If you do not know yet, my name is Jessica and on my channel today I'm going to make a few, one, two, maybe three Halloween treats. So here we go. First I'm going to show you my little candy haul I got for Halloween treats that I'm going to be making. Gummy eyeballs. And they are gummy gummy. Very shiny, almost looks real. Squishy. And then some hard candy eyeballs. And then Wilton. You got some axes, some cleavers, some butcher knives. These are all candy, they're all edible edible fingers, edible hard candy eyeballs, just bigger and more detailed, Grim Reaper, Frankenstein hands and some black sprinkles, the Mellow Cream Pumpkins, Some Reese peanut butter cups, white candy melts, and orange candy melts, black sparkle gel, black icing. I know I can make my own, but this is going to make it quicker. Orange icing. Green icing, some pretzel rods, Meyer brand, Oreos, some of these candies, I got two of those, purple sprinkles, Green sprinkles. Well, they're sugar crystals. Some more Halloween sprinkles with some ghosts and uh, pumpkins. More Halloween sprinkles with some tiny eyeballs and more sprinkles. And then this one has pumpkins, black, green, and purple sprinkles. Yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. <laughs> Is that funny? These are all Wilton. And then I got these for uh, corn salad that I'm making tonight for dinner. But I also found these cupcake wrappers. They are Halloween. And I got a couple graham cracker pie crusts and some chocolate jello. Oh, and edible blood glaze. of jello chocolate pudding that I'm gonna make and if there's leftover I'll just put it in a bowl and uh, yeah they'll eat it <clears throat> so for this pudding which you can make your own but this is just a quick Halloween treat more for the decoration to show you All right, so I'm gonna see actually how 
much this makes for just two packages. <clears throat> I'm going to need six cups total of milk, cold milk, three cups per package. Putting in first. I think two packages might be enough. Here is my six cups. And give it a good stir until it starts to thicken up. Oh uh, yeah, don't hand whisk, use an electric mixer. this for two minutes but <coughs> you don't have to stir by hand you can put it in your table top mixer or well, countertop mixer or So while the pudding is sitting in the refrigerator and thickening up, we're going to move on to the next treat. Yeah. A little bit of these candy melts. Got water in this pan underneath it. I'm gonna melt these candies. I got water in there, like I said. Just put this over the top. Don't let your your pan, your metal bowl, touch the water. Turn your heat up on high, and you'll see they'll start. They're starting to melt. want to remove it every now and then so they don't burn. And we're done. Some of these pretzel rods, make sure they're whole. And probably get my brush, get some of this and kind of like paint it on halfway, like half of the stick, I should say. I should probably do that over this. And then 
and I didn't open my sprinkles. Well, I got one of them open. Sprinkle some of these on there. Hope they stay. Just one side. Kind of continue the process. You could put a lot of different things on these. Like for instance, uh, let me see. Get this. It's candy eyeballs. If I can get them open. Oops, <laughs> that went backwards. Oh well. <laughs> Put it right here. Get my. I should have had this all open already. I don't know why I didn't. Okay, my, my eyeball fell off. So, I'm just going to hope it stays this time. And then. Kind of put some blood on it. Break them in half.
I'm gonna take my gel, my black gel. Oh, I gotta cut the top. Put a little eyes on there like a ghost. Okay, that's the end of the video for today. Uh, if you're new here, don't forget to subscribe. And thank you for giving me some more of your time and watching my videos. See you guys next time.